Hey guys, my name is Sam tonight, and I just got hit twice. Um, here we are. I just recorded episode six, and every time I look up at the camera, because I have the thing turned my way so I can see myself to make sure everything, you know, the, the camera, it's never happened before, but in case, like, the camera doesn't freeze up or something, uh, or something doesn't look good, uh, and I was looking up there, and I was like, something's missing, and I realized that the, uh, the blue fuzzy blanket had fallen in between episodes. Because every episode I stop recording and I, uh, I, um, move the footage over, put it in its own, uh, folder, and then put that folder in my unedited footage folder, which is ever growing at this point. Uh, and then tonight we have a huge, I say it every time, but we actually have a huge. Like, I know when things are gonna have a chance of falling through, and I know when... I usually know when they don't. Uh, and this one, it's like, all four of us, me, Dimitri, George, and Michaela, we've all got... we've set aside our time, and... Me and Dimitri are doing the new Overkill map, and then... We're all gonna play a bunch of games together. Probably, uh, this Green Meanies game, and then, um, or Mean Greenies, I don't know exactly. And, um, probably a bunch of Ark too. So, I'm excited for that. Um, I just love recording with everyone. I just do. It's a great feeling. Everyone getting together and doing stupid shit. Alright. Now down here is where you actually can get immunity to water, which is really good and extremely important actually for total map coverage, especially, at, nope, here too, I was going to say especially in the inverted castle, but then I'm like, I just thought to myself like, they're the same castle though. Oh man, they got so much reach. This is four hundred dollars. Yes. Whoosh. You know what I want is I want the soundtrack of this game for like my car. Ooh, Claymore is two-handed. Sammy no likey, but if you likey, that's finey. I just no likey. I don't like two-handed weapons. Take too long to swing. Moonstone! Saving time, because something's about to happen. I think the last episode was arguably the f I can't remember. Maybe the second one as well that I You ever seen a save room like this? That I didn't have to fade my face out for talking. It's probably fine. Mother! That voice! Alucard, it's you! I'm coming, Mother! I'll save you! No, Alucard! Don't come here! But, Mother! It's all right. If my death can save others, I gladly surrender my life. Mother, no! Please, no! Yes, Alucard. Watch me die, and remember always my last words to you. Yes, Mother. You must despise humans. They are to be your prey. What? Better for them to die than to let them compound their sins. Begin by slaying that one over there. No, it wasn't like this. What's wrong? Alucard. My mother never said such a thing. 
What do you mean? Kill them and bring them happiness. No, you're not my mother. What kind of demon are you? <laughs> you broke free of my spell. I like that. Demon, death is too good for you. Come here, little boy, and show me what you got. Okay, so that happened. And she's just like the uh, bat boss, kind of. At the, uh, she's a little bit more advanced than the bat boss in the last one. But if you keep her like up in a corner, you can pretty much just. Oh shit! I didn't want that to happen. Ah, damn it! Damn it! Boss fights aren't that hard if you know what you're doing. Darkling, I smell your blood. You're a vampire. Could it be? That strength, that beauty, you're the son of Lord Dracula. Death in the dream world will set your soul wandering for eternity, demon. Wait, I beg of you! The one thing about Symphony that people say can be a downside is that once you play through the game once or twice and you know what to do, it gets kind of easy. And I see where they're coming from, but it's still f really fun. And you can just make it not easy by using a bad weapon or, you know, you can challenge yourself by doing something not recommended and it's, it's fun. I tried to beat Dracula with fists once. It didn't work. I had to, uh, like, uh, the no healing challenge, uh, rar, punchy punchy challenge. I just made that up now, on the spot. <laughs> the rar, punchy punchy challenge. That, that's an old reference. Duck Game was a long time ago. Another boss fight. Punchy, whack, 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 out, whack. I don't think you're supposed to be here right now. I think you were supposed to come here. For I don't know what the intended order of the game was. I don't. I don't think this was it. Because I don't think you're supposed to be able to like get locked in a room with an enemy and then kill it in four hits. This is the real boss, though. And yes, she's naked. Stop pausing. behind her, she can't hit you. Wait, she can hit you with those. That's so cool. Life max up. Now this, this, this cloak is, I'm gonna put on for a second. It's like, kind of see-through. It's really cool. I like it a lot, but, I mean, you can't beat the blues, man. You just cannot do it. Is that better than Harper? Probably not. No. So you can sort of judge where you're supposed to be on, like, the strength of the weapons that it gives you. I, I, I don't think you're supposed to be here just yet. Or, or, or you're supposed to be here a while ago. But, like, I don't know for sure. No, we can't. Uh, the fairy man hasn't been called down there yet. You, there's, here's, here's what happens. Is the fairy man gets called by that telescope that we used in episodes, I think, two or three. And he shows up all the way to the left down here. And then he takes you to a place that calls him down there in that trap door that I just opened. And then he takes you across all the water, opens up a, like a hatch thingy, 
It's like this big wall that just goes up only when he's driving you. And then you can get across and get the thing that makes you immune to water. Which is really nice. I'm just trying to get... Ah, damn it. See? Another reason I come down here last is so I can have a lot of health. So I don't need to wait for the water immunity. And I just go in the water and fill in the map as I go. I'll get that in a minute. Something has appeared near the wooden bridge. Got it. Everything's fine. Man, I'm one away from 200 health. It's kind of freezy in there. Kind of cool. All right. <laughs> in the face. Kicked in the face. Now up here leads here. Such a nice transition hallway into a nice place, but from an icky place. And now I'm back at the beginning. But now this path is opened. For if I need to come back, which I Probably will not. Ever. For any reason. And here's the fairy man. I'll take you to a place which might be interesting for you. <laughs> Honestly, reminds me of George. Not sure why, just kind of does. Uh, wait, was his name Karin? I think I think he's the guy who takes you across the River Styx. Oh, that's right. I forgot. Like extended lore. This is the River Styx, I believe. Don't quote me on that. I just know they like to cram every mythological mythological thing they can into Dracula's castle. All right, now this. Oh, that's cool. Uh, the merman statue calls him to the other place. Now, I'm not coming all the way back out here. Oh, shit. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and fill in a little thing on the map right here. That, I swear, I, I don't know if it's a thing or not, but it feels like because of luck mode, I take double the amount of damage, or at least twice as fast. Okay. Nice. Now if you're good enough and careful enough. This one gets kind of picky. You gotta like scrape the wall. Secret boots make Alucard's avatar a little bit taller. That's all they do. Oh no. Let me out. Let me out. Okay. I missed a mushroom. I don't need it, but I want it. Shiitake. Alright, now it's just that one room, which I will get the waterproofness for, because you're under the water quite a bit. Now, that guy who throws the thingy is what appeared near the wooden bridge. Oh, wait. I need to actually turn off my sword for this. So there he is. 
Same keeping his head on the edge of the screen there. Thanks, friend. Like Max up. And down here is the catacomb catacombs. Really messed up stuff down there. And one of the most iconic Castlevania bosses is also down there. He goes by two names, I believe. Uh, Legion and Grand Falloon. And Grand Falloon is the name he goes by in this one. I don't know who thinks of these names, but I like Legion better personally. It fits his everything. I'll guide you to meet your destiny. No, his name's just Fairy Man. It's not Karen. Karen, however you pronounce that. I think they might have named in, in one of the ports, or maybe even the original. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now, this room that we're going across right now in the Inverted Castle is probably my least favorite room in the entire game. Yes, no. It, see that? That. You could come in here without him. But that thing wouldn't have gone up. And there it is. Holy symbol, it's just a snorkel. And now I can go underwater without any problems. Uh, normally I like to race him, but I have uh, map coverage to, to happen. I haven't leveled up in a long time. I cannot tell you how happy that makes me that you guys are actually interested in this game, because I wanted to wait for a thousand for this game so more people could see it. But then, you know, you guys, I took a, took that poll, and then you guys were like, um, how about 500, please? So, I'm happy about it. Alright, we're gonna save. And we're gonna go fill in the map in the next room, and then we'll go into the catacombs. I don't know how long this episode's been, probably too long, so we're gonna go save in the catacombs and we'll end the episode in there. Because I'm trying not to have these go on too long. I don't want them to go past 23 minutes. I, I would actually prefer them around, like, 18, but I don't cut anything out, really, unless it's backtracking, and the backtracking part of the game is almost done. There is zero backtracking, really, in the Inverted Castle, unless, like, you need to get somewhere and you want to take a different route. The, the Inverted Castle, you could just, like, go in and it just, just go through everything once, because you have already unlocked everything in the game. Like, abilities-wise. Most of the... mostly. Like, like uh, accessibility maneuverability-wise. Fish head. Creatively named. Also, you cannot turn into a bat or mist down here, but you can turn into a wolf, and they can do this, and he can swim. And that really only helps in the inverted castle when you're trying to scrape the walls, but the water is up, and you can't just fall into the water, you have to, like, swim. Life up and an elixir. Maybe not the. I don't remember. There's the life up. Two nineteen. Anti venom. I thought it was an elixir for some reason. All right, all the underwater stuff is done. Nice. And now we go down here. Slash! Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna kick off the next episode. Fantastic. You know what? I don't know how long it's been. I didn't pay attention. 
I'm gonna go on a little bit more though. I feel like it hasn't been very long. My max hearts. I am. It's Cerberus. built this game there's exploits to every boss you if you know what you're wait a minute I don't have the demon you get him down here I had to really rack my brain for that one I always do that you would think one of these times I'd remember you don't get him until right here This is the final keyhole. Oof. Yep. Final keyhole. And now, because of this, and I'm not going to use it this time, I can now travel all over the map. Now there's one secret we have missed so far. The ice brand kills these guys in like one hit. It's great. Now this is a moment in the game that George loves to quote, and I don't blame him at all. Here we go, here we go. Where is he? There he is, my little demon. Hmm, a switch. Why don't I press it and see? Bah! That wasn't supposed to happen. That's all I ever really used the demon for. It, it's the same in the inverted castle as well, except he says something a little bit different. Wait, uh, you can level up your familiars. Um, okay. I think there's a Venus weed in this next room here. He's also naked, don't pause. Yay! Now this ring is my favorite thing. It brings your defense way down, but your attack way up. So things are really gonna hurt. But, oh, let me show you, uh, I know I said I wouldn't use the duplicator, but I want to show you my favorite combination of things. Um, you put on the duplicator, and then you put Power of Sire. Coral Circulate? That's... Immune to Curses. Wow. And if you look closely, that thing, it's a picture of uh, Vlad the Impaler. Like the real Dracula. Go ahead, pause it. See? Isn't it cool? I'm still using it. I'm exploiting this few seconds that... I have allowed myself. It's fine. That's just what I like to do. I like to equip the power of sire and then go bonkers with it. Alright, we're gonna put back that. Actually, if I could get something with defense. Because. The Ring of Ares makes you, like, super beefy. Like, you can you can murder anything, but they can also murder you. And I'm already in luck mode. 
So, now before I save, I'm gonna go right over here. And grab this. Bloodstone. And then the cat eye thing is like... I oh, the music down here is cool. Alright. We are going to take on the catacombs, and oh my god, we're gonna get to Richter in the next episode. That's exciting. That's exciting. Oh boy. Alright. Be sure to check in for the next one because I want to see you there.